from the original 1927 Bristol Sessions, which were the first uh, successful commercial recordings of country music or traditional Appalachian music at that time, or I guess it's what we'd call it now, but country music at that time. And um, a lot of people, you know, those sessions are really associated with Jimmy Rogers and the Carter family and the Stoneman family. Uh, but there were people from all over Southwest Virginia came, and there were two groups from Wise County, which is where I'm from. Uh, the first group was, I, they were a string band that went by the name of the Bull, I think it was the Bull Mountain String Band or the Bull Mountaineers, um, that is actually Jim and Jesse's grandfather uh, was actually present at the Bristol Sessions. And then the other family was the Baker family from Coburn, Virginia. Um, they were kind of a Carter family-esque family. They must just not have had the right look, though, because they were <laughs> very similar, and it was a family band. It was um, a guitar and on the harp. Their son played the mandolin, um, and they recorded this song, which um, I'm not sure. I, I have a feeling this kind of, uh, this was a published song. I don't believe that this was a uh, traditional song. Minstrel songs and all kinds of published sentimental parlor music yeah. or whatever kind of all plays in there. Right. And I was going to make a note thinking about the Carter family. I meant to say this earlier. Kate Peter Sturgill, um, when we did Deep Subtle Peace, is actually A.P. Carter's cousin and was one of his um, sort of wellsprings for material out of Wise County. She did a lot of song collecting him in that part of Southwest Virginia. So, just a note: if you're if you're like us and you're big Carter family nerds, you might want to know that. <laughs> so, um, I'll sing you a little bit, a little bit of this, and then we can kind of go over it. Sleeping. 